it seems microsoft is hard at work in monopolizing large language models for pcs just like what they did with windows these days most of the world runs their laptops and desktops or in other words pcs with windows now just few hours ago microsoft released this copilot plus pc which is an ai laptop and i did a video on it and you can find it on my channel just search with ai laptops are here and you should be able to learn more about it not only that microsoft has released this on device small llm which is i believe 3.3 billion parameter model which will live within your windows that's right you can access it easily you don't have to worry about it you don't have to install it or do anything about it it is going to simply live in your system my, this 53 silica is the name of this model and this will be embedded in all copilot plus pcs when they go on sale starting in june this year it is the smallest of all the five models with 3.3 billion parameters and i already have covered the whole family of five models from mini small medium to their vision version and they are a very very good models so now we will have 53 silica which you can access right from your own windows laptop through powershell and through various other means and um, i will also show you a code snippet from microsoft's website which you can use on your copilot pc whenever you will have it and you can simply do the inference with that model without even worrying about its technicalities microsoft is also going to ship this llm or slm whatever you call it slm is small language model microsoft is going to ship it in every copilot plus pc and right now those are the only um, models available but it seems that soon we will have intel and amd chips will also join in and i think by the end of next year this will be just a routine and normal thing for every pc you don't have to worry about it you won't have to worry about getting any key from chat gpt or meta or anyone else all you need to do that it will be embedded in your pc also it seems to me that this silica file is some sort of quantization level of memory because it even runs just in 3.2 gigabyte of ram which is really good so it seems that the all the neural processing units or npus are optimized heavily for int 8 precision so i think this really makes sense and really amazing stuff so i think good step by microsoft but i just hope that they won't monopolize this large language model arena just like they did with windows now there is a full api reference for fire silica which you can find on microsoft website and i will also drop the link in videos description now let me show you that how you can use windows app sdk the code of course whenever you will have that copilot plus pc let me take you to my vs code let me make it fit under the screen so this is the whole code which you need to run that's it so if you look at this code what is happening here is that we are getting a single complete response based on a single prompt or string prompt from the model from your c sharp code so with the local file silica language model and the windows app sdk you can generate text responses to your user prompts i couldn't find any image one as of yet but maybe if you dig deep through the sdk you might find some so if you go through this code what is happening here is that first we are ensuring that the language model is available by calling the is available method and waiting for the make available async method to return successfully once the language model is available then we are creating a language model object to reference it and then finally we submit a string prompt to the model using the generate response async method which returns a complete result and then that's it once once you run it it is going to give you the response from the model easily also you can do streaming on it and then there are a lot of things which you can do this model with this model through the code and as i mentioned if you want to look at more example all you need to do go, to go to this api reference for this silica model fire silica model and should, should be able to see it so you see there are some 
uh, different classes here close open system string and it goes on and on i'm not going to go through them you can just read them at your leisure so exciting interesting times are ahead so this battle is now going on to the on device so let's see what other companies do but very very uh, smart move from microsoft i have to say so that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it let me know what do you think about this fire silica if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching